the art fairs have changed the, the global art market and I think the arrival of an art fair in India you know, whilst it may be modest this year compared to say um, Art Miami where it probably take you about six hours to just walk around the, um, around the fair I think that in five years time you'll see a massive shift and I think that a huge numbers of European and American galleries are interested in selling art into India, and um, you know, Indian art has featured on the international platform for the last three or four years. India at the moment there's a problem with institutions that you don't have the same promotion and support that the artists get in the UK so perhaps that's one of the reasons that it's taken longer for it to catch up but at the moment I think people are looking to new markets they've done China so India seems to be next on the market. Collectors are buying not just one kind of art, they're buying modern, contemporary video art, photography, works by British artists, Western artists, Chinese artists. So we are seeing both a breadth and depth. Uh, we're seeing collectors also collect uh, a lot of work by one particular artist, so sort of deepening their collection. And uh, we're also seeing curators help collectors curate a very tightly collected uh, collection. There's a recognition that there is a lot of Indian art that's of interest, and right now it's focused on relatively few objects and artists, but it will broaden. Um, and uh, it will also move downwards in time because uh, the very big prices have gone to artists who've deceased or who are very, very old, like Hussein. Um, you know, but it'll begin to go. Gupta is probably the first person to get big prices for relatively contemporary art, but it'll, it'll broaden. Well, I think it's got a lot to do with the Indian, uh, India taking off. And India has been brought to attention, you know, to other, you know, to the world. And it's, you know, it's the Indian diaspora that is also buying Indian art, a lot of, in, you know. So I think that's what's happening. And it's, it's, I think it's also part of a trend worldwide where contemporary art is the thing.